You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. Right now, many senior citizens are in our community are learning and enjoying the game of pickleball. And Larry Nyland brings us the story of this game's emerging popularity. If you've been near Drake Sports Park the past couple of years, you've probably heard this addictive sound of a ball hitting a paddle and wondered what exactly that is. Well, that sound is the sure sign that pickleball is being played. The best way to describe pickleball is that it's a hybrid of tennis, ping pong, and badminton, and it's quickly becoming a great activity that people of all ages love to participate in. On this day, a group of beginners came out to get their first taste of this burgeoning sport. And what better instructor to have than someone who helped bring pickleball to West Bloomfield? In 2016, I wrote a letter to West Bloomfield Township saying they needed to get pickleball courts in here. They had this great sport that's coming around. So they got these pickleball courts in 2017, and then I went and said I'd like to te start teaching it to introduce people to get people excited about it. And I wanted more people to play. So I said, I'll teach some courses here. I'm an instructor in Florida, so I'll teach for you. So I taught last year, and I taught this year. This year, we've had easily twice as many courses as last year, and many people interested. Pickleball is played on what looks like a smaller tennis court, and it does attract a good many tennis players. But they soon realize that it's not quite the same sport. It, 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 it's a different game. You, you need a different stance. You, you, you need a different shot. You, it, it's a completely different game. The easiest part to me was returning the uh, serves and returning the, uh, the hits from the other side. The hardest part was serving. But it's a lot of fun, and you know, for those of us, for well, more senior citizens and we can't get around like we used to on the tennis court, it's a great game to play. And while pickleball is tremendously fun to play and a great form of exercise, the social aspects of it are just as important for those who participate. As we get older, uh, it is harder to meet new people. And I want to stay active. I want to stay active until the day I die. So I'm trying to find things to do. And here I have both the best of both worlds. Not only can I stay active, it is the best cardio workout getting out here and doing this for two hours. And you meet new people. You're playing with new people. You don't know them. You, your paddle's right in line. You three people. You will play with them. Oh, what's your name? What's your name? Oh, okay. Well, you want to play again? And, oh, we play again, another game. And people have now become my friends that I would never have met before. And I get, like I said, the best cardio workout, never go to a gym ever again because you're out here. And what happens is you're out here playing for, let's say, an hour and a half. And you go, oh, my gosh, I've been out here an hour and a half. Anybody ready for another game? From West Bloomfield, reporting for The Splash, I'm Lawrence Nyland. For more information, you can visit civiccentertv.com slash pickleballfrenzy. Thanks for watching this segment of The Splash. To watch the entire show or other segments, catch us on Comcast Channel 15 and AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us every week on 89.3 WBLD, the all-new Lakes FM.